Hello again everyone and welcome. In my previous video I suggested the importance of youth acknowledging the value of elder wisdom and insight. Our elders had gained this wisdom and insight over the years of their lives, facing relief after pain, triumph after trauma, and breakthrough over barriers. The value of our elders cannot be digitized or uploaded to or from any cloud server. This value is rooted in the experiences of their individual and collective lives. Their wisdom is shared between generations through family gatherings and other events. However, we as elders must acknowledge the potential of the youth for creativity, ingenuity, and connectivity in today's world. It may be useful that we encourage youth to develop their talents and experience in life, but we should always be available to offer advice, observation, and support when needed, or to draw attention to some pitfalls of life that they might overlook. We elders might have a tendency to resist the new technology, media, and communications. The internet, for example, is a digital web, a maze of communication, content, and media that can be intimidating at times. Even the smartphone, a mainstay in today's world, can be a challenge for those of us from the old school. This resistance is, is mostly unintentional. We may be anxious to stay abreast with rapidly changing trends in technology and con connectivity, or uncomfortable with the new ways of communication and information sharing. We may become uneasy moving out of the comfort zone of our seasoned habits as we face these changes. However, positive change can add value to our lives and affairs, and the youth tend to easily embrace change as they navigate through the world. Processes that took earlier generations days, weeks, or even months to complete can now be completed in a matter of minutes or hours. This level of efficiency has the potential to help us to move toward progress together for mutual benefit. The blending of the wisdom of the elders and the energy of the youth provides the potential to achieve greater heights of learning, building, and development for our families, communities, and societies. We, as elders, have to recognize when to step backward, not step away, to allow our youth to grow and excel. Our youth have to also recognize when to seek the existence of an observant soul to the nuances of life. Together, the generations can build with value and commitment for further progress. Thank you again for your attention. Stay well and stay safe.